Now, with a lot of aquariums, if you go overstocking it too quickly or do anything else silly like too big a water change or clean out your filter with tap water, overfeed or anything silly like that, you can end up with ammonia or nitrite. Now, ammonia and nitrite are poisonous to fish and they break down into nitrate, which is not real good for fish. Now, it's very common for people to use water ages such as Prime, and they'll use these at a five times regular dose in order to detoxify ammonia and nitrite and nitrate. So it doesn't necessarily get rid of these problems, but it does detoxify them so the fish don't know it's a problem. But if you are using these tactics, such as high doses of Prime or similar, Safe, um, there's so many products that do this, then you must view it as a short-term goal because you definitely want to um, find a long-term solution. A long-term solution is make sure your tank has good aeration, make sure it has plenty of filtration, make sure it's not overstocked, not overfed, and make sure that um, your ammonia and nitrite levels remain at a good level, ensuring you don't clean your filter out with tap water or anything silly like that. So you really need a long-term strategy for ensuring that you're not relying on detoxification with products such as Prime. But if you are gonna use products such as Prime, it's really important that you're doing regular water changes because products like Prime can raise the GH level of the water, particularly if you've got soft water fish. So try to couple your regular um, detoxifying with increased water changes to ensure that the GH of your water doesn't actually get too high. Anyway, if you have any experience with this particular topic, make sure you put a little note on the bottom of this video. If you're feeling particularly abusive, just write something stupid. And um, don't forget to subscribe to this channel.